Hello Photo Mechanic users! This is John from Camera Bits, and this is a tutorial on using the Photo Mechanic software. I'm going to show you how to download and install Photo Mechanic on a computer running Apple OS X. Then, we'll show you how to enter your registration information. In this demo, we're on version 5, but this should work for most modern installations. First, go to the website camerabits.com, click on Downloads, and find the latest version compatible with your operating system to start your download. When you click on the link, the download should begin in a few seconds. This is what it looks like in the Safari browser. If you use another browser, like Chrome or Firefox, it may look slightly different. Most Macs are set up to download to a Downloads folder. Once the installer file has downloaded, go ahead and double click it. Here's the end user license agreement. Feel free to pause the video while you go over it. All set? Click agree to get started. There's a readme file here. This will have notes about the latest version of Photo Mechanic. Go ahead and drag Photo Mechanic into the applications folder. You can also drag the extra file in it or put it somewhere else. It contains some tools for creating web galleries and adding advanced functionality to Photo Mechanic that we can get into at another time. Once that's dragged over, we recommend that you eject the installation file in the OSX Finder. Now to run Photo Mechanic, find it in your Applications folder. You might want to drag it down to your dock for quick access in the future. Double click on the gear icon for Photo Mechanic. And here's the registration dialog. If you've purchased a code, click Register. It can be helpful to have your registration email handy while you do this. You'll enter your name exactly as it appears in the email. If your registration lists a department, then insert that exactly as well. Note that pasting has been disabled in this window. Your registration code goes here. Make sure not to add any additional spaces before or after the code. If you get it wrong, it will tell you that the information doesn't match. Just click OK and go back and double check. We know you're excited to get started, but take your time. When the information matches up, Photo Mechanic will tell you that it needs to contact the CameraBit server to handle the activation. If you've got an active internet connection, click Yes. Activation might take a few seconds. And there it is, activated and ready to use. So to recap, We've just downloaded Photo Mechanic from the Camera Bits website, installed it in the Applications folder, and created a shortcut in the dock. Then, we registered and activated the program. Stay tuned for more tutorials about getting started with Photo Mechanic. If you have any trouble, please stop by our support forums or contact us through the support link on our website. Have a great day, and happy photographing! <music>